How do you say goodbye? If you're watching this video and you're past the point of breastfeeding, there's a good chance you've asked yourself this question. The answer largely depends on your language, arrivederci, sayonara, and adios, to name a few. But past that, what do you do to somebody you might never see again? Enter Ankit. You might look at him and think he's loud, obnoxious, and an overall menace to society, and you'd be right. But he's one of the greatest things I've gotten out of college. He is the smartest person I know. He's kind, fun, and he's graduating. So how do you say goodbye? Today, I'm here to offer you a 10-step guide in saying goodbye, starting with step one, planning in advance. Probably six months. He actually really does like football. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Oh, he likes League, yeah. But if you're trying to say goodbye, you need to think bigger. Something I thought would be really cool is if like, I got him tickets to Japan, which is a place he's always really wanted to go. But the problem is, after I got the itinerary planned, Japan, Close. So now would be the time for improvisation. I have a crazy plan. Could you pretend to be a film student and like ask to interview him so we can get some information out of him? Yeah, I could do that. I got a friend who Ankit doesn't know to interview him, ask him a bunch of questions, of which include... And if you could go anywhere in the world, where would it be? Mm, anywhere in the world. I'm a big like sucker for like Spanish music entirely. So um, anywhere like in Mexico, Caribbean, um, my passion would be to like record more, take more samples of life in my day-to-day. -day. Ha! And just like that, they have fallen into your trap. After that, you want to talk to some travel agents. Then you're going to realize the best place to go is Costa Rica. <laughs> Vamanos! <laughs> I'm broke. Traveling is expensive for one person, let alone five. Uh, that is your main victim and then three of his best friends. So what do you do now? You make money. Lemonade sands. Uh, selling feet pictures, taking sponsorships on a hypothetical video that you'll make about the trip, selling more feet pictures, and then, and only then, can you surprise everybody. I had some girl I know pretend to be a film major and interview him. <laughs> and so, we're going to fucking Costa Rica. You know what's even more fire? You're coming. Stop. You're coming. You're fucking coming. You're fucking coming. You're you're coming. No, you're, coming. you're coming. You're coming. You're coming. As you are, you're coming. <laughs> you're fucking coming, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you're fucking coming. You're coming. You're fucking coming. You're fucking coming. What? <laughs> now, for the person you're saying goodbye to, you have to be a little bit more extra. Maybe uh, you get a billboard for them, or maybe a billboard car. That'd be fun. So Honestly, any trip would be fun. We'll figure something out. Do you want to just like sit here, we can set up the camera and talk? Yeah. I'm gonna miss you, buddy. Okay, yeah, don't get that on camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna cry, dude. The fact that. What the fuck is Go to Costa Rica, bro. Look, go to Costa Rica. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> if you give me a bath right now, I cannot point to you where Costa Rica is. Neither can I, so... <laughs> oh my god! Yeah. Ah! Do you remember when McKenna interviewed you? Yes. That was me. I asked her where you wanted to go. <laughs> You're so evil. You're so evil. <laughs> oh! I have another thing I've got to show you. No, no, no. No, 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 no. It's good, it's good, it's good. It's good. It's good. Is there a human in here? No, I wish. Oh my god. <laughs> They're coming too. Actually? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> then you're gonna want to head inside for the last surprise. He does not. El gato? You do not. <laughs> she does not. It's important that you make transportation as seamless as possible. I feel like we just took shortcuts and like this is a video game. <laughs> that looks scary. Oh, because I'm brown? <laughs> hey, yo. This might be the last time you see them, so make sure with all the hard earned money you made, book yourself a nice resort. What is this? <laughs> Also, make sure the place is all inclusive.
and after a successful first two hours, you make sure your camera gets attacked by the ocean, and then let them know. We need to be up by 6 a.m. tomorrow. 6 a.m. I'm there. I'll be there, yeah. What else I'll be up by 5. Oh. Take a guess what we're doing today. Take a guess? Okay, this is I'm my guess, Volcanoes. And then after they get it wrong, you let them know that you're going zip lining and horseback riding. Take a brown horse. What does that mean? <laughs> Why is Thalia the most consistent through line in this video? Anka being brown. <laughs> he started it. Reaching the perfect form of communism, even in like Marxist ideals, I I still believe would lead like to a form of stagnation. Yeah. I can't wait to cut from super like <laughs> he like hectic <laughs> screaming to a talk about Marxism. We're literally we're literally the political economical conversation right now. <laughs> God, like can we talk about like the political and economic state of the world right now? Your quest for a perfect goodbye may be interrupted in order to dunk on some random Costa Ricans. Saying goodbye is hard and existential dread may begin to kick in. Make sure you have some distractions. How about some massages? Maybe you can take everybody out on a sailboating trip. Dude, I'm so scared. It's too late. Enjoy the beautiful view. Dance to your heart's content. Just make sure you don't get seasick. Throw up everywhere. Jump off boats and go to a deserted island. I'm gonna handball visit the shore. <laughs> you made it! Yay! Yeah, <laughs> Maybe you can surprise all of them with some surf lessons. Oh! But despite all of the money and planning you can put into a goodbye, sometimes life's best moments come unplanned. And with luck on your side, maybe you decide to take that luck to a casino. Maybe you decide to bet it all on green. I miss Toontown. I miss Club Penguin. Toontown. A lot of people say like for childhood they miss like not having responsibilities. I think I miss like not having judgment. Kids like have no like sense of like divisions or like no sense of judgment. Like if they really think something is cool, they'll do it. They won't worry if it's like also like cringe. Black cringe. Oh, oh my God. Oh, 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 oh it landed God. on me. <laughs> so after getting dive bombed by that lizard, you're thinking I back to a point in time happened. in which your oh victim said, God. life like this sure is great, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and they'd be right, but it can get better. How about you take him to a volcano? Say to the other, I love you. Uh, is it, I love you. Is it, is it that? <laughs> That's so, that so embarrassing. That so That's so embarrassing. I just think you look so cool on camera. I'm just think I'm talking about. Oh. 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 Yeah. That's so crazy. <laughs> That's so crazy. Welcome. It's clouds. Do you see that? Go to the clouds! The greatest vision I've seen in my life. No, like genuinely. No, this is it. No, they have these chairs here too. Look at this. <laughs> and now it's time for the big surprise. It's time to unveil the fact that the reason you traveled five hours by car to a new location isn't just to be at some nice volcano. It was to intercept your other friend who happens to be vacationing in Costa Rica, neither group knowing what is about to happen.
At this point, you might be totally out of surprises. I think it's time to dial things back. Maybe you take them to a nice, calm observatory. It doesn't fit their vibe, but it's okay. Because maybe you get lucky and there's a nice waterfall. At this bougie ass volcano resort, you save oh. one more surprise, and it's that they film the fucking bachelor here. Oh, oh my god, damn it. Which one though? <gasps> Not real. Is he? Get out of my bed! <laughs> this is not. Did you just fart, Arkin? No, I swear to God. This dude just tooted on my. Oh, this is the light. Costa Rica is beautiful. You know, I'm just really excited to uh, make some memories with the girls and get to know them a little bit. We had a lot of fun together. I'm gonna have to give Miss Kid the last rose. What the? Ah. No! No! It's also selfish to say goodbye alone, so maybe prepare a video. One thing about Ankit I would never change would have to be his personality. It's never boring to hang out with him. How much he cares about others? His ability to make me, make us, everyone in the room laugh. He cares a lot about people, which I really admire. I hope you enjoyed Costa Rica. Anthpo, signing off. I graduate in 331 days. Uh, it didn't really hit me that I just lost like a large quantity of people, um, some of whom I might never see again. I'm sure that I'm gonna reconnect with Ankit, but never like it's been here on campus. Dude, I just realized like you graduated. Yeah, it like just clicked with me. What do you mean? Like it's just you've been like such a constant. Like, it's just clicked uh, with me that you're not gonna be here next year. Okay. That's so sad. Oh, it is sad. I literally just thought about that. Oh, uh, yeah, bro. Yeah. Okay. Not that much of a concert. It's been a year. It's been a good year, though. It's been a good year, yeah. Um, and what is advice you'd give to incoming or current Rutgers students? Mm. You're kind of discrediting yourself if you're coming to a college campus and you're going to be one kind of person. I think there, there's such a wide variety of people here, such a wide variety of options. College is like a really unique four years where everybody's trying to figure out what they're going to be and. If you're gonna decide freshman year, I think you're doing yourself a disservice. So like, I guess like be open-minded and be um, willing to kind of um, be more than one person, be like a, a person you didn't expect yourself to be. I was talking to a cop, bro. Don't worry about it, don't worry about the cops. Got a sponsor. Oh, actually? Yeah. It's a business. Thank you! Wondershare. Shout out to uh, Wondershare. Shout out to the sponsor. Really quick before signing off, I want to give a huge shout out to Wondershare for making this entire thing possible. For those of you who don't know, Wondershare Filmora, it's an editing software for everyone, especially for beginners. Uh, if you're looking to get into editing, you're looking for an editing software, Wondershare Filmora is a great place to look. One of the best parts about Filmora today is that they've got an effects store called Filmstock where you can find tons of effects. They've also got a mobile app called Filmora Go. They also made me a fun little effect pack based off of like how I edit my videos, which is super dope. Uh, if you guys end up using this, tag me uh, using the hashtag Anthpo with Wondershare. All you have to do is download Wondershare, add your own clips, go to the elements tab, type in Anthpo, and you'll find my series of customized stickers. There's a bunch of different types for every single mood, like happy and sad. Just drag the assets you like into the timeline and you're good to go. And you could also be doing this on their mobile app, Bill Moore Go. It pretty much operates the same way. The best content under hashtag Anthpo with Wondershare will be receiving free licenses. So make sure you guys, again, use the hashtag Anthpo with Wondershare. Check out the link in the description if you're interested in hearing more. Yeah. Yeah!